kita uh, tidak akan menyebutkan nama itu sampai kita sudah uh, pasti dan kita akan menang satu proses itu kita dan all boleh ada pesan. So, jadi kalau kita kasih tahu dua kawasan tu, I think strategically it's not right lah. Hmm. Yeah? So jadi kita kita buat trade secret. Ah, tentunya kita rahsiakan lagi dua kawasan. Jadi, uh, dari bulan ratus wanita ni untuk Sri Kandi berapa usia? Uh, kalau di Selangor kita ada uh, uh, satu calon Sri Kandi, ya, yeah? satu calon Sri Kandi. Adi Dun. Gan Pini di Rawang ya. Can I ask? Income ya. Regarding Selangor, uh, the number of seats uh, is done based on on the basis of uh, internal survey uh, and uh, uh, the nineteen seats and twenty uh, eleven parliamentary seats. Uh, yeah. Does it mean that uh, you are confident also of part of the retaining the Selangor uh, state government? Yes, definitely. With the kind of uh, projection that we gave, uh, definitely that uh, we will retain Selangor. Yeah. Yang sembilan puluh lima peratus tu untuk persediaan pilihan raya. Pilihan raya tu siapa? Yang lima peratus ni kan tak belum belum. Campaign lah during the week itself lah. Campaign dan untuk mengwarwarkan calon dan sebagainya. Finishing touch. Finishing touch. Because all the preparation dah siap. Selalunya macam macam saya bagi contoh Abno sekarang. Abno di Kabalisan Nasional. Dia punya biggest headache sekarang sebab calon tak siap lagi Jadi bila calon tak siap, dia tak boleh print poster Jadi poster tak siap, bahan apa ni, bahan uh, publicity semua tak siap lagi Kita dah siap semua dah In fact, I think we have a problem because jentera kita tak sabar-sabar nak pasang poster So that, that's what I mean by 95% Yang tinggal lepas ini hanyalah bawa calon pergi ke pasar Ketuk pintu and so on So it's a, it's a house to house The actual implementation yang I think, uh, in fact, I think this is the best yeah. prepared version, I think. Yeah, of course, throughout the years, about 14 years, uh, yeah, I think it's the best uh, prepared team that we have. So, 5% of the uh, calum, we will go to the road, 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 agar uh, mereka lebih familiar dengan calon ini tapi walaupun bagaimanapun kita pasti logo pakatan itu yang akan memenangkan kita dalam perang ini insyaallah. Ya. Yeah. Uh, 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 sorry, I just want to check with you because I checked the candidates list and you guys are PKL is going to contest in Semenyi which is also a place which one of the places that PSM a comrade actually has actually uh, comrade of pakatan has actually decided to uh, contest. So so what's happening actually between Okay, with regards to Semenyi, there is a, a one level of uh, understanding uh, with uh, PSM uh, during the last election. Yeah, so the agreement was uh, it was um, uh, given to PSM, and uh, if they don't win the seat, it will go back to us. Yeah, that was the agreement. But however, uh, there are a few things that we know that PSM has been a bit uh, vocal in uh, coming up with some statements. But we want to reserve some of the internal discussions that we feel is not uh, right for us to expose. Yeah. So, and uh, we are still settling this matter. But on the bigger picture, uh, Pakatan Coalition, the AP Pass and Keadilan, we, when, uh, we have to receive, if you need to receive another member, they have to accept the whole policies and ideologies that we bring about. Yeah. So that has to be settled first. So how do we settle when we have a partner who don't agree with our policies and ideologies, and it will not be putting right the Pakatan coalition? Yeah, you want to win. Yeah, so that's how. So there's a this level which you have to settle, and uh, okay, we hope that if we settle well. Then if we settle well, then we are, we got no problem. Uh, we having uh, PSM to come into Pakatan and use Pakatan logo at the two seats that they have won, uh, Sungai Siput and. Uh, Kota Damansara and semuanya, we apa expert that I mentioned earlier, we still can also apa discuss, but they have to settle the big issues, yeah. Ingat kalau can I can I add on that a bit, you know? You see there are two distinct between is it an electoral pack or is it PSM as a member of Pakatan Raya? Because because now I think 
you know, there's already talk about PSM becoming member of Akatan Rakyat. Because if that's the case, there are a series of things that have to change. Uh, not just a question of Lamba, not just a question of Loko, because uh, joining Pakatan Raya, unlike Barisan Nasional, you know, Barisan Nasional is an electoral pact. It is not an, an understanding of policy of sorts, because Barisan Nasional tidak ada perlembagaan, tidak ada dasar bersama, nothing. So it is an electoral pact, so it's be easier. In the case of Pakatan Raya, we are governed by our uh, any common policy by Wabukujinga and so on. Any member or new member for that matter must fully subscribe to that. So so this is where I think the internal discussion must take place. Is it going to be an electoral pact? Is it going to be uh, a coalition? And if it's a coalition, then therefore PAS and the AP and PKR would have to decide as a coalition. But at the end of the day, what is most important it is about bringing down Barisan Nasional and the factor of winnability uh, and suitability for each um, constituency to point, uh, we will have to figure out and discuss for you. The discussion is ongoing. In fact, Dr. Sri Anwar was kind enough last night and, and we were shocked because <laughs> we thought that we were going to announce Kota Damansara, but he didn't. Uh, so he didn't announce because precisely discussion is still ongoing and as much as I think the problem is because PKR has to negotiate with everyone, all the parties because PKR is a middle ground party we contest in the widest spectrum of seats you know, and, and race you know, it's a, it's a mid seats pun ada, Malay area pun ada, Chinese area so in Sabah and Sarawak pun our seats as well, traditionally so of course when it comes to um, seat negotiations, PKR is the most affected because uh, usually it's PKR seats that are being requested. You know? So uh, we have about another one week. I'm sure at the end of the day we will resolve everything in the spirit of bringing down Pakatan, uh, bringing down Barisan No, 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 I'm not being paid, don't worry. <laughs> bringing down Barisan Nasional because um, we fully understand the hope of, of the public and the people, then this is about change and we must iron out anything that even um, discourage people about mood for change and, and I think the leadership of every, of every party including PSM will make the right decision, we will compromise and PSM will compromise and hopefully hope for the best in the next few days. But, uh, with the announcement by Mm. But isn't it in the sense that almost confirmed that uh, Sumanis will be contested by PPR guy rather than the PSM guy? Because the announcement was made. Kota Ramansara was left out. Yeah. Yeah. You can get it this way that uh, Kadilan have uh, candidates to offer in these seats. Yeah? Like we said, as Rafi mentioned just now, we want to work for the best. We have for another two, three days. If there's nothing better than that decision, we will go for the better decision so that uh, we can uh, bring down the <coughs> test. Uh, you mentioned in your statement, uh, dual currency do uh, two more state, uh, states are being uh, uh, discussed. Uh, which are these two states? One is Kota Damansara, am I right? Mm -hmm. What is the name of the other state? Mm -hmm. Which one say. is different? This one. No, this is Slamo. Slamo is just Kota Damansara. Just Kota Damansara. Yeah. Yeah. But, uh, Chime, uh, I think when you refer to the two, two seats, seats, so two seats that we those are the two seats that we think that we need a bit more work, work, work in order to win. To win the it's got nothing to do with that. Yeah. We think that out of 21 seats that we are contesting now, we should be able to get 19. So two more seats require some 19 is already in the pocket. <laughs> <laughs> so you want to name the two seats? Uh, <laughs> what is, what is, what into this time, you will mention all the 21 seats you will get into the pocket. <laughs> For what reason is this two any particular, is it electoral fraud or um, is Well, a mixture of, a mixture of factors, I think. Um, our own strength, as well as the demography, as well as the you know uh, the type of constituents, increased voters. It's a mixture of the 